hey everyone welcome back on the channel welcome back to another miscellaneous type of video today we are taking a look at uh, dlss 3.8.1 which just released uh, along with the dlss tweaker tool which will help you to set the different preset of dlss and i will also be showing you some comparison uh, with not my own video but uh, with the help of uh, this channel's video uh, this is a very good channel. I'll link the link to the original video and his channel in the description. Uh, you can check this channel out. Uh, he regularly posts uh, comparison video between drivers, game updates, DLSS updates, etc. etc. So yeah, without any delay, let's start this video now. So first I will show you what is the difference between the DLSS 3.7.1 and 3.8 with uh, the help of this video. So first let me turn on the video and reduce my sound to zero because I don't want any kind of copyright issue. So yeah, anyway, so here you can see he's testing on uh, Starfield. Now if I pause the frame right here, you can see it says DLSS 3.7 in this side and 3.8.1 in this side. The preset he is using is performance preset because the most noticeable difference in the new update is in the performance section. Like when you set the graphic subscalar to DLSS subscalar to performance, you will see less shimmering. So if I play the video, uh, I don't know how much this video can capture, but if you look at this location of the left side video, you can see it's a little bit shimmering and if you look it at this side you will see it's uh, not shimmering at all it's very much a stable uh, you can also see that uh, the vram usage has been reduced a little bit like uh, previously it was 4.3 and now it was 4.1 uh, so i'm using this video because i don't get uh, much time to record different version of dlss then put them side by side and compare them with three to four games uh, so yeah anyway uh, after the performance preset we will jump to the quality so keep an eye here all right now it's the quality preset there is very less difference in the quality like you can see it's almost similar but if you still look carefully you can see a little bit shimmering going on here but this is totally stable also you can notice the vram usage is also a little bit lower in this section let's begin the installation and show you how to install it with the dlss tweaker so first we got this dlss uh, 3.8.1 so we're going to extract it to the desktop uh, and today the game i will be testing it on is uh, ghost of tushima so first we copy this dll then we go to the installation directory of ghost of tushima for me which is uh, here i think no here ghost of tushima director's cut so if you want to paste it here you will be asked to replace the file because dlss is already present in this directory where the ghost of tushima.exe is located so you need to replace it so dlss has been pasted now all we need to do is uh, paste the dlss tweaker tool so we have extracted it here now after that we're going to copy everything and paste it here now after pasting uh you will see dlss tweaker config.exe so you need to run it as administrator now for the first time users uh, you will be shown a prompt which says enable driver signature override yes or no so you need to click on that yes button after that you will see some ui similar to this so in order to change or set the preset you will need to scroll down here and you will see something called dls preset uh, i have heard they have removed the presets a to d only efg is remaining but i don't know in my case it's still shown uh, so i don't know if i apply a b c d maybe they will not get applied or something so yeah for safekeeping i'm just using the e and f preset because these two are the best preset like when you are using dlss on performance uh, generally rtx cards are pretty much powerful they can run any game on like uh, quality or balance but if you are using performance preset uh, you can consider using the f preset which is uh, very good so i'm not going to set it on dla but i'm going to set it on ultra performance and performance mode 
and for the balance preset i'm going to use the e for the quality preset i'm going to use the e so after you have completed setting your presets you can just click on this save button and the dlss tweaker tool will save all your dlss preset now when you jump back into the game and set dlss on for suppose quality or balance or performance your particular preset will be set on that uh, dlss preset so yeah uh, this is the whole process now i'm going to just show you some gameplay of ghost of Tsushima maybe and uh, yeah uh, this will wait for this video so i hope this video will help for the rtx uh, users now if it helps you you can consider subscribing to the channel and uh, join discord for more upcoming videos and uh, discussion and everything and i'll see you guys in the next one so until then cheers huge price drop on wukong at just 199 indian rupees the stock is very very limited so hurry up star wars outlaws offline activation starting at just 400 indian rupees with all the new and old games and windows 10 and 11 serial key the stock is limited so hurry Find out who's responsible. About time you showed up. You're welcome, Sensei. Tomoe is behind this. She sows paranoia and fear. Attacking caravans, blaming us. I caught up to his group too late. Saved him, but not the others. Where was he ambushed? Close. Why? Find the ambush site. Track the rest of Tomoe's group to their camp. That makes sense. What's wrong? Nothing. She has me off balance. We'll put an end to that. Rest here. Eat the food I gave you, and wait a while before you leave. Thank you, Sensei. Show me where he was ambushed. How did you find me? Someone heard a convoy being chased. People avoid the roads because of Tomoe. When I caught wind of a merchant chancing a supply run, I followed. 